Hey everyone, we have a couple new cars in this week. First up, Audi RS6 Avant, which is Audi speak for wagon. This is the latest body style, platform code. I forget if they start with B's or C's, I think C. It's like a C9. I'm not an Audi expert, so please don't kill me for getting that wrong. This is a neat car to me. I'm, I'm a wagon guy. These have four liter twin turbo V8s pretty close to 600 horsepower. This is a really neat color. It's like a matte or satin purple with a saddle leather, I guess I'd call that. This is by GT Spirit. So non-opening resin. Um, a couple different companies uh, that sell in China have a opening die cast, but I haven't had my hands on one. So not quite open mesh in the back and open mesh in the front there not on the sides so I'll take what I can get paints good wheels and tires are good I think these had carbon ceramics for brakes they're usually kind of grayish when shown on a model like this like the real car again nice heavy good model Love the subject. This is car number 1024 at 1199. Kind of a weird number. They're usually like 999 ish. Underbody detail is actually pretty good. You have the painted exhaust system, which is kind of a nice touch. Uh, retail about 129 to 150. This was on sale at Replica Cars uh, for I think 69 or $79. Replica Cars does still have a lot of good stuff on sale by GT Spirit if you want to check it out. Plain black new box at least gives you a picture of what it is. So also from GT Spirit in the same lot from the same sale. This is a Koenig Far 308. Koenig was kind of a crazy sort of 80s sort of like tuner kind of the way that Gambella was with Porsches. They wide bodied everything put on BBS wheels and twin turbos so in the early 80s, this was like a 200 horsepower car that today would be beaten by most minivans, but add twin turbos to it, and they were reasonably quick. Gotta love the BBS period mesh wheels. There's your interior. Again, sealed resin, but no one else, I don't think anyone else makes this subject matter. This is car number 691. I have the 999 you'd expect. Wheels are good, paint's good. For flaws, look at this. It is what I call kind of a rocky peg legger. Fairly common with my resin cars. This one's not the worst, but whatever. It is what it is. Again, this was, I think, $69 from Replica Cars. Retail for about $150. At that price, I'm not mad at it, even if it does wobble. Same packaging, black box, with a little sneak preview. So that's it for this week couple resin cars. I think we gotta mix it up and throw in some opening diecast next week. That's it for this week. Please everyone like and subscribe and have a good one.